right? Watching me tumble like that. <laughs> but hey, do you know what just has happened? Oh, here we go again. Well, this is nothing but an earthquake. A small one indeed. Come, let me tell you about earthquake today. The surface of the earth is like a jigsaw puzzle. Yes, it's not a single piece of land, but approximately 20 pieces of puzzle that constantly move. But you don't feel it, because they move quite slowly. Each one of those puzzle pieces are called tectonic plates. So, whenever those plates hit, bump, or slide past another plate, an earthquake is caused. But hey, don't be scared. Most of the time, we don't feel earthquake because they are so small to reach us. But sometimes they are so strong that they can be felt over a thousand miles away. The instrument used by scientists to measure the intensity of earthquake is known as seismograph. Now, let us talk about how to survive in an earthquake. In simple words, earthquake are nothing but checking, rolling or the sudden shock of the earth's surface. But what's scary about them? That they can occur at any place at any time. This destructive and unpredictable nature it is crucial to be aware of safety measures one must take before, during, and after the earthquake. The first thing you must do is always listen to the radio for the latest information and instruction for your area. Once you hear the news that need everyone's attention and discuss with your family and friends, you all must, you all must arrange a supply kit that includes enough food and water for several days. Plus, make sure to secure heavy items like refrigerator, air conditioner, television, and objects that hang on the wall. Try to put heavy and delicate things on low shelves or the floor. But remember my friend, earthquake warning will give only limited time to prepare and often it will hit. So in case you are at home caught between the traveling ground, not to panic, try to stay calm. And in the first few seconds after the shaking start, run to the other way that anything could fall and injure you. Immediately implement the safety method called a drop, hold on, or cover. So in doing an emergency, where you are, drop with onto your head and knees and cover your head and neck with one arm and hand. And if a sturdy table is nearby to you, crawl underneath it for shelter. And hold the table with one hand and ready to move with it if it moves. And stay in under the table if it's shaking till stop. After the earthquake, go to your home and inspect your home damage and if possible, so help the other who's need. Thank you for everyone. Jazakallah, Khairan Kasira. I request you, please subscribe our channel, City Public Library and visit there. Thank you.